dinosaurs, robots, and testicles in this episode of Conspiracy Literacy. What the fuck is wrong with me? Um, hey YouTube, what's up? It's kind of been a while. It's kind of been a long, long while. But, uh, hey, I'm making a vlog. And, uh, can you hear my voice? It is not completely back to normal. So that's great. Yes. Uh, my hair is a little crazy right now. I kind of just woke up. It's like, oh, you know, good morning, Matt. Why don't you go put on a suit top? Rock and roll. Why not? Um, so if you don't know where I've been, I was at VidCon. <clears throat> and VidCon was amazing. VidCon was so great. Um, I was also in uh, Arizona for around a week or so. Um, I loved Arizona. It was so fun. I was in Phoenix, and uh, I had such a great time. I stayed with Edwin's generation there, so please go look him up and be like, Hey, you're awesome. Thanks for taking care of Swift Karate Chop, because he did. Literally on, like, the last day of VidCon, <clears throat> at, like, 2 o'clock, I just, like, 2 a.m., I randomly just, like, got ru really sick. Um, not, like, drinking sick or anything like that, but, like, physically sick like my body was like hey bro time for you to go to bed so I did uh, I was like in the bed in the hotel bed like shivering and stuff it was horrible and then the next day <clears throat> I was just completely jacked up I had no no idea what was wrong with me it was like my whole body was like just super like shut down which wasn't great because I had walked all the way um, I'd walked several miles while at VidCon, and uh, so my legs were like sore, and then on top of that, I was like sore from being sick, so, you know, I was like, my body is not working right now, oh my god, so it really sucked, uh, I slept like a full 24 hours, and I still didn't feel like 100%, like right now, my voice is still like, blah, 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 but um, I guess I feel, oh, oh no, <coughs> I'm, I'm perfectly fine, I'm perfectly fine guys, there's nothing wrong with me at all, <laughs> but um, yeah, so, uh, I've been sick, but I've, <laughs> Edwin and his brother Ruben, they took care of me and like, got me medicine and like water and like, put rags on my head, and um, I was just a big worthless piece of shit. And that was great. So I really am thankful that they were so nice to do that. So that was all really awesome. Um, then I came home on the 3rd and had a delay in Denver. So that was great. I got a delay, which I normally have delays in Denver. So had that. Whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Had a delay there. I'm finally home. That's all that really matters is I'm home right now. And that VidCon was awesome. I met so many amazing people there. Um, hopefully, I don't think I was not sick when I got there. I lost my voice an hour and a half after being there because I just was not prepared for VidCon and how loud it was going to be. So I was like, hey! What? It's so nice I made you! And then my voice was gone because I was yelling a lot. And, uh, so that didn't help either because my voice was, like, all damaged and raw. And then I got a cough randomly at the very end of the night on the last day. So, yeah. It's just great. So, if you met me there, hopefully you are not sick. I really hope you're not sick because I will feel really bad if somehow I got you sick. But I don't think that I could have got anybody sick because I think that I actually got I got sick from someone else is what I feel like is somehow like maybe I caught something that was lingering around on somebody I don't know because I like to hug people and that's what I did I hugged a lot of people and it was great um I just had a really great time I had a really great time there was like 7200 people at VidCon this year so last year there was like 2300 or something so it almost more than it almost tripled basically uh, more than tripled there, someone told me there could have been 3,000 people last year at VidCon 
So if that's the case, I guess it you know it did a little more than double, but you know I kind of want to say it was triple than what it was last year. So at least triple. So that was great. Um, I, it was just amazing, guys. It was amazing. I really hope that you can go next year. I'm really thankful that I got to go and meet so many amazing people because of the fundraiser. Nia and Maria are so freaking awesome. I hung out with them in Arizona, and we got ice cream, and then we went and played some Dave and & Buster's, and uh, I just had a great time. I had a really good time, and now I'm back home in this crap. I'm in Alabama. And don't get me wrong. Alabama's great, but I just have, like, drama here right now with some roommates and things like that, so I literally think I'm about to have to move into another new apartment and that's horrible. Um, <clears throat> Adam was telling me that uh, in psychology, there's supposed to be like a point system to uh, stress. And after you hit like 150 points, you're supposed to be crazy. But um, there's supposed to be like moving is like 40 points or something like that. And um, it's supposed to be like a dissolve over time and also. So... I'm probably literally really close to becoming crazy right now because of all the crazy shit that has been happening and the stress is just like insane. But, yeah. So, we gotta look for new apartments. Um, and, uh, good news is I got the suit. I also got a vest. And, uh, I can now film my conspiracy literacy channel. I'm extremely excited about that. And, uh, I'm just excited to make videos again. <sighs> really, guys, this is great. What's happening right now feels so good. You don't even know, because I've not been doing this for over a week. And now I'm making a video. And it's a very magical feeling right now. Um, and I'm excited to start filming videos for my main channel again. VidCon was such an inspiration and such a revival to how I feel about YouTube. It is no matter how much YouTube is like really changing the people in the community are really not changing you know and so it was so great to meet so many of the people who watch my videos and so many people who don't watch my videos just random people because I did I was just hugging random people they're like I don't know you I'm just here to take a picture with you for my friend and I'm like ah. and they're like this is freaking me out but uh whatever I had a great time and it really did it's inspired me to make my videos and stuff again it's inspired me to be very active again and uh, to hopefully overcome all this dramatic BS stupid stressful crap that really ultimately like probably doesn't matter you know whatever doesn't matter but uh this is good it's just us again and I'm excited and hopefully I will avoid showing you my penis and leave it all to your imagination Imagination land. I can't sing right now because my voice is very fucked up. <laughs> well, um, I'm sorry this video is extremely long, but I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope you were able to get over my crappy, shitty voice. And um, I look forward to interacting and talking to everybody again. Yes, so awesome. Um, hopefully, I will start doing some question eight style stuff again. Oh, hiccups. No. But, um, you know, I don't know if question 8 style stuff, but, you know, I want to be able to, like, share advice and stuff with people also, so I feel like, <laughs> that'll cough a lot, but, uh, that, that'll be really cool. Um, okay, ah, guys, it's so great to see, it's so great to see you guys. Okay, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I know a lot of people at VidCon was like, um, I'm really tired of you starting your videos by being like, uh, hey, it's been a while since I've been a video, and I'm sorry. And I'm also really tired of you being like, I'll see you tomorrow, and then you, you don't. But, uh, yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah. Um, but, I will see you guys tomorrow. Alright. Yeah, see, look. I feel differently this time. It's different. It's real. This is real. See you guys. I'll see you guys. That's my wrist. Look at that. Ugh. You guys want to see something awesome? Okay. So what? Look. I had to have this suit tailored. Now. Ugh. 
That's all my wrist shows now. Can you see? Okay. Before I had it tailored, it was like here. So, yeah. But, okay. I'm going to go get a shower and get ready to start my day. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. And if I met you at VidCon, it was such a pleasure. Goodbye.